<laughs> okay. Well, so honestly, uh, it made me very itchy <laughs> because these are the kinds of things that I, it's actually making me hot <laughs> right now thinking about it. These are things I always think about in the context of other people. And uh, so that there were some people out there that thought that I was um, someone to be nominated was a huge honor and um, yeah it uh, and you know the best thing about it is that it's great for boys and girls clubs because uh, the more we can tell our story the more we can do more and that's uh, you know that's a pretty great outcome. Well May, Mar May Brown and Marguerite Ford are forces to be contended with and they and I have been in cahoots since the 70s when we were on city council together. So this is another cahoot and they, <laughs> both having received the award themselves, are trying to pull me into the fold. So they nominated me and how did I feel? A little embarrassed that I should be in their august company, but uh, thrilled that uh, they would go to the trouble of nominating me. Sure, I, I, was, I was really surprised and really, really quite actually overwhelmed, mostly because I was, um, you know, I heard, so I was in, in the shopping mall on a Saturday and a, a colleague of mine who was part of the nomination um, had let me know that her and a number of other women had put my name forward and I was pretty thrilled because I respect them so much and uh, as friends and co-workers and mentors, so it was, a, it was a pretty big thrill. I was honoured and I was humbled. It was very difficult for them to convince me actually to really actually accept the award nomination, but I'm here, I'm proud to be here, and uh, delighted with this honor. I thought I was being punked. <laughs> uh, no, I got the call and I was exhilarated. It's such an honor. I mean, the YWCA is such a beautiful organization, so, and they're doing amazing work, and to be affiliated with them through this nomination is very exciting and a huge honor. Wow, so the moment I heard that I was nominated with one of my very close colleagues, I was really surprised for certain, um, but quite overwhelmed. My first reaction was, no, 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 this is, this is about the team, this isn't about me. Um, and then she responded and said, you know, we put a lot of work into this. And I, I was positive, I was super excited, but I, I thought, geez, no. And. Uh, and then as soon as she said, we put a lot of work into the, into the proposal, of course, I said, oh, wonderful, I'm excited, I can't wait to see it, uh, but mostly overwhelmed and, uh, and excited. I was uh, working very much in the community when the YWCA Women of Distinction Awards was launched over 20 years ago. And so, in fact, we were one of the, uh, I was president of the Strathcona Community Centre Association, and we were one of the organizations that thought, what a fantastic idea, women in Vancouver need to be celebrated. So we were one of the first people to buy a table, we did a nomination, and so in, in that way, it's been interesting, um, you know, that the YWCA award has always been uh, something that's been part of my life. Um, for, later on down the road, I became a board member of the YWCA, so again, you know, being a board member, attended the galas, and, and just really supported this, uh, this uh, award. Anyway, the, what happened later is when uh, it was, I was first approached to be nominated, it was of course a huge honor because by this time this uh, award had grown into such a prestigious and recognized award. So absolutely it was an honor to be nominated and when I heard that uh, the nomination was um, put forward, I was actually in Ottawa and I got an email from my assistant who said, I have some great news for you. And so it was really an honor to be nominated and it's some, something I'll carry with me for a long time. I think the moment I was nominated, I got a phone call from YWCA and they told me about the nomination. It was actually a message. And I just felt very warm. I'm, I'm thrilled to be a part of uh, the YWCA community, that, that I would be recognized by the YWCA community. They do great work in the community. And so to be seen by them is as someone worthy of a nomination, that in itself is enough for me.